Well, everyone, my name is Luke Holden here from WSLE and BeastNews.org, and I'm here with Nick Harbath. What's uh, going on? College lacrosse recruit for uh, UMass Lowell. So, Nick, my first question for you is, uh, when did you first get a thought in your mind that you'd be a college athlete? Um, you know, I played club lags in the summer f since freshman year, so, I mean, it's always a thought that I wanted to play college lacrosse. You know, I, lo I love the game, and I love the people around it, so, I mean, it was always kind of a big thing for me to play college lags, so... Uh, so how has the focus changed from you as a middle school athlete to being like a high school athlete in terms of your work ethic and your ability? I mean, once you get to high school, it's a completely different game. I mean, I know you got weightlifting, uh, school is a lot harder. So, I mean, it's really hard to, I mean, not hard, but I mean, it's a way to balance everything, you know, and mm -hmm. just, you know, kind of create your own way of doing things. So what's been your favorite part of the recruiting process so far? Just all the schools, they're interested going out and traveling to different places, you know. I went to Connecticut, New Hampshire, Massachusetts, New York, you know, all the areas in Michigan. So, I mean, it's really fun just traveling and seeing the different kinds of places in different states. Yeah. So, my next question is, uh, when, do you, when did you know that UMass Lowell was your school? You know what, I had offers from a couple of schools, but the big thing that kind of drew me to Lowell was, you know, the beautiful campus. Uh, student size and you know um, just kind of the atmosphere and uh, you know it was just like I want to spend the next four years there and I was just really excited to go there. How different do you think your schedule is going to be when you get to college next year? It's going to be hectic I can't lie you know I my brother played college lags for a year and um, you know they had 6 a.m. lifts practice I mean school it's just it's all about time management and getting everything done. Yep. When you first started talking to colleges, what were your sort of feelings towards becoming a recruit? It's exciting. I, I'm not going to lie. you got to enjoy the recruitment process, and, you know, you're getting recruited by a school, which is a really cool thing. So, right. I mean, you should just enjoy it and, you know, have fun with it, but also take it serious because, mm -hmm. I mean, not everyone gets to have this privilege. Have you ever had times where you wanted to just quit and give up? <laughs> There's always been those times where you're just like, dang, you know, it's hard, it's tough, but... You know, you're not going to die, I hope. But, I mean, <laughs> it's always, you know, one more step and you're going to be there. And how have you kind of found yourself to be able to bounce back from those moments? It's all about the people around you. You know, I've, we like uh, Anthony Aloisio is going to Davenport. We have a good group of guys where we work out and everyone's pushing each other and just, you know, having fun and getting after it. Yep. And who in your life would you kind of credit your success to? I mean, my whole family, my brother, my mother, my father, my grandparents, I mean, everyone's helped me chip in their, you know, two cents into the situation and mm -hmm. what they think I should do and stuff like that, so. Well, thank you, Nick. Hopefully you guys did enjoy that little interview. My name is Luke Holden from WSLE and BeastNews.org, signing off.